What's up, everybody? We're here in the hot box. I'm here with uh, my partner, Daniel. And we, guys? we have a new uh, prototype that we've been talking about for quite a long time. At its beginning stages, the backbones of the units here. We'll talk to you a lot about a lot of the options that the unit has today, right? Yep. But we're going to go over this. It's going to be the IQ on absolute steroids, uh, 7 by 10 inch plates. This will be our Pro IQ made for all commercial use. And uh, today, what we we're gonna do something a little different, right, Daniel? Yeah. We're gonna inquire from you guys um, what you'd like to see in this this machine, and explain to you and show you a little bit about how we build and design a Nug Smasher. This unit, for instance, is built all around your touchscreen brain. Tell us about that. Yeah. So basically, the, this machine and the IQ and the Pro Touch and the Touch all share uh, a similar touch platform, basically. And this is what this is based on as well. So what you see here is kind of the, the frame, the skeleton, all the structural stuff, right? All the strength that's required to hold that kind of pressure in for those kind of plates. And, um, and the power to get the accuracy. Yeah, too. exactly it's right. Speed motor in this space. So that's the other thing we're adding to the touch platforms that keep expanding and have more capabilities. And one thing we're adding to it is a variable speed control for the motor. So this motor will actually be uh, not just an on-off, but an actual variable speed. Meaning we can control the um, pressure a lot, you know, even even to a exact, rate. yeah, yeah. And with the full seven by ten inch plates on this bad boy, I mean, uh, an alchemist will really be able to yeah. uh, do a high production, high run. And what's really unique about it, and we didn't know if we were going to be able to do it or not, is the frame on this machine and how it it you have access to all three sides. Right. Um, but not only that, we have some options, some some different options that we don't have any other uh, of our other machines on this. Yeah, we're adding a few more uh, sensors to this machine. This machine is going to have an ambient temperature sensor as well as a humidity sensor as well. So it'll tell the ambient sure. temperature your room you're in and your humidity level. Yeah. Um, it also has uh, more lighting options than the other systems. We're right. adding some additional lighting options. Different that, stages. Yeah, it'll have more uh, configurable things you can change, even colors, stuff mm -hmm. like that we're playing around with. Um, speaker, audio output. Oh, audio. Yeah. So Australian. you. Know, well, we're, we're, yeah, we've got, we've got a solution for you on that, where you <laughs> right, know you can perfect. hear it, smash yeah, is done, yeah, that sort of yeah. thing, some kind of audible, yeah. you know, uh, indication that a smash has been completed. Well, this is, you know, it's I'm excited about the machine. We've been talking about it for a long time, Daniel. You know, I mean, I, I I can't wait to get this in the hands of all the all the people that want it. You know, this is for all of you guys out there that are watching. This is a uh, uh, how we start with it. So this is the basic backbones, like Daniel said. Um, you know, it'll be built out in all stainless uh, casing. Uh, you know, it'll have a touch screen on it. Now that's, we don't know quite where that may go. It may go up top um, with the tilt up possibly as an option. Sure. Um, encased or it may just be a stationary on the front. Uh, but you have some other options coming with the uh, Nug Smasher app in conjunction with the... Uh, yeah, there's uh, remote control functionality being worked on right now that when that gets pushed out for the whole entire touch platform, you'll be able to remote control uh, a touch machine, including this machine here. So you'll be able to operate it from your phone, your iPad, mm -hmm. and that sort of device. So that that could be a solution too for Absolutely, the alchemist yeah. out there that doesn't want the screen below. Where yeah, you can just use it by the app. His, has his paper or whatever, yeah. Suggestions, guys, please leave them in the comments. Let us know what your, your thoughts are. We're real excited about this machine and all the, all the features that it's going to bring forth and just the the real commercialability of it. Um, us being able to, in our own machine shop, uh, machine the parts, the, every part on this darn thing, um, and, and designing it right here, uh, vigorously testing this RAM, which is a, a three and a half inch uh, inside diameter RAM. You can see how massive it is. All the fluids contained in here, and it's a airless system. Uh, that's one of the things we wanted to achieve is have a completely sealed airless system that was completely internal uh, that can give you the precise pressure on the exact surface area size that you, you're putting in the machine, mm -hmm. um, give you that, that uh, consistent high quality uh, material back. So please let us know what your thoughts are. We're in the midst of designing the rest of this, putting all the hardware on it and actually designing the casing right now. So uh, we'd love to hear from you guys. What am I leaving out, Daniel? You know, I. Look for more, I guess, more little updates as we kind of go along. We're kind of just a little sneak sure. preview, stuff like that. But make sure you're always liking, subscribing, you know, following us on the channel. Tell a friend. Tell a friend. Guys, until next time, uh, appreciate your support, and uh, we'll see you soon. Yeah.